My name is Sarah Gray, I'm the Chair of the Activity Den Children and Young People's Project in Tanfield Lee Stanley. The Den is a youth project that was set up around 15, 20 years ago for children and young people uh, who did, we didn't, they didn't have anywhere to go. We've got a lot of different groups of children and young people. We've got the Woodcraft Fort that's actually been running in Stanley for 30 odd years now and that's been running in the Den since 2001. We have a music project on a Saturday called Sound Hub where young people come and learn either drums or guitar or take part in singing workshops and they also showcase their music at events. We also have youth clubs for ch uh, children and young people on a Wednesday and a Thursday for different age groups. I think on a typical week we have about 100 young people coming to the project uh, for specific events, like we've got a Halloween event, so something for older people. I think that everyone's got to remember that coming out of the pandemic, loads of people are anxious, whatever your age, and coming into them, it, people, you might be here five minutes and you'd be feel so welcome. The kettle's always on, come in, have a chat, youth workers are friendly, the kids are, it, it's a really nice and welcoming place. There's a lot of friendship groups that come in, but there's also lone, like, kids who just they don't have loads of friends or they're quite happy on their own and they come in and they're happy to chat with anybody who's here, which is really nice. So it is a welcoming place where they can come in and actually say, look, I don't know anybody, but I'm going to find someone that I, I can make friends with. And that's really nice and important. It's funded by a range of grants and some donations from parents, so we apply to lots of little small trusts like Sir James Knott, Hadrian Trust, so it's lots of small trusts um, and also we get some funding from the Area Action Partnership and local councillors. We've got a computer suite for young volunteers, we've got lighting rigs, a stage for when we've got performances on. Tonight we're having a karaoke because that's what the young people have asked for. We've got a disco pod, we've got a fully functioning kitchen and then we've got loads of crafts and sports, we've got a pool table, we've got lots, we really have lots of resources. In fact it's like such a big building we haven't really got enough storage anyway so we've got a lot of equipment it's, uh, it's well invested in. Are lots of projects and there's not just the activities and there's Octil, there's Stars Young People's Project, there's Packed House Do Stuff, there's also there's the activity den, there's lots of different organisations out there. There's something for everybody wherever you want to go. Um, there's not just like bog standard youth club a couple of hours a week. There, there was actually a lot of provision out there. Because it's a youth project and it's designed and it's where young people manage it, they're part of it, there's not, um, young people have a say, they've got their stamp on it, it's bright, colourful, they, they know that they've got a lot of power in here so they can like, they, they volunteer from quite a young age, they make their volunteers cup us, they help us out and it's really, they've got a stake in it, it's not just them coming into a building for a couple of hours and using it, it's actually their project and they know that and they're really proud of that and we're proud too.